working on? Well, I'm working on my greatest creation. I promise you'll see it when you're a little older, okay? Okay. Gem and the Holograms, directed by John M. Chu, is a seriously fast-paced movie that follows a stereotypical shy girl named Jerrica Benton, played by Aubrey Peoples, who uploads herself singing on the internet as her alter ego named Gem, and it goes viral. The next day, she and her sisters arrive in L.A. and have a contract and concerts all ready to go. There's a pretty montage of the girls receiving makeovers and becoming rock stars, all thanks to their uptight manager, Erica Raymond, played by Juliette Lewis. Oh, and fun fact, a robot also makes an appearance and takes the girls on another adventure. The whole message of this movie is to never be afraid of who you are and don't hide from it. From the director that brought you the Justin Bieber documentaries, you could clearly make out that the concert parts were the absolute best with crazy beautiful cinematography. The performances gave the audience chills from the talented voices of the cast to the girl power anthems. It truly felt like a live concert. The movie itself was a now typical story where someone gets instantly famous off of social media. It has been done before and I was not shocked with how it went. It was so unrealistic, but I did like the stylistic choice of using real people's YouTube videos as the background music, especially for the anxiety-ridden parts. So, is this movie worth the price of admission? I would have to say yes, but only if you are under the age of 16, otherwise you will get lost in the unrealistic side of Hollywood and the whole cheesiness that is this movie. Also, if you can get over the fact that there are about 10 different storylines going on at once, then this movie is for you. Are you thinking about seeing Gem and the Holograms? Leave us your thoughts in the comments below. From the Price of Admission team, thanks for watching.